let's go to 25. 25 speak about the solid rocky. Yes, solid rocky means air science ear. Number 25 speak about the air science. Now, air science, let's go to see it. What's the average thickness of the solid rocky parts, which is above the acetone sphere in mantle zone? What are the thickness? We must remember the thickness of this. So the answer must be, let's read it first. A, 30 kilometer, B, 70 kilometer, C, 100 kilometer, D, 170 kilometers. The answer must be A, A, 30 kilometer only. Let's go to the next question, number 26. Oh, 26 has two pictures. We must study the picture or the figure if they found in the question. There are two pictures, one of them, one and two. Let's read the question and study the figures. Uh, the question speak about the study that two following figure carefully who must study it. Study the two following figure carefully, then choose the correct answer. Here, this question must be studied carefully because we are in English exam. But here, he put number one at the right side and two and the, and the left side. So we must study the number of the figure to uh, not be confused. Number E, both are tectonic geological structure produced by the effect of environmental condition. No, one of them must be um, from the environmental condition and the other geologic structure tectonic. Here, the answer is both are tectonic. No, there is no. The answer is not, is it? Both are primary geological structure produced by the effect of interior, internal environmental factors. No, one of them is internal, but the other no. Number one is produced by the effect of internal factors. Is produced, number two is produced by the effect of external factors. D, number one is primary geological structure and two is secondary geological structure. No, that's the answer must be number C, because one of them is internal factors, affected by internal factor, and the other produced by the external factor. Which of them are internal? That's one. Number one is internal factor, but two is affected by the environmental factor, so the answer must be C. C is the correct answer. Let's read it again. One is produced by the effect of internal factor and two is produced by the effect of external factor. That's the right answer. Let's go to number 27. Number 27 is earth science either, geology. 27 speak about the carbonate mineral. Carbonate minerals has many structures. Carbonate means that found their structure are consist of carbon, carbonate, CO3, which is not scratched, cannot be stretched, scratched, cannot be affected by scratch, scratch by the human finger. So it not soft. And it's the base of cement industry. Wow, there are cement industry. Which of them are not stretch it, scratch it, and go to cement industry? Calcite, dolomite, malachite, hematite. Let's go to the answer. It must be calcite. Calcite is consists of carbon dioxide, uh, CO3, carbonate, and go to the cement industry. So the answer must be number A, calcite. I like Georgia. 28, which of the following is the best description of the sugar crystals? Yes, go to crystals. What are the crystals? Sugar crystals, I like sugar. 
let's go to read uh, the choices to make acute choose. Are considered as a mineral because they have definite crystal shape. No, it has no definite crystal shape. Uh, it's not a mineral. A mineral is the breaking down of rocks. It is the building unit of rocks. Sugar is not a rocks. Number B, are considered as a mineral because they have definite chemical composition. Yes, it has a definite chemical composition, but it's not a mineral. Number C, are not considered as a mineral because they are manufactured. Sugar are manufactured. I like sugar. D, are not considered as a mineral because they are solid. So the answer must be C. C, because they are manufactured, not a mineral. Are not considered as a mineral because they are manufactured. They are manufactured sugar by evaporation, the sugar juice, sugar can juice. Yes, let's go to question number 29. X and Y are two minerals. They are a comparison. There are a comparison between X and Y. We must consider that. Are two minerals of glassy luster. Glassy luster means as a luster, uh, uh, like a glass. The first is scratched by a metal coin. First one is X, scratched by a metal coin. And the other is scratched, the strict plate. Yes, by a strict plate. So, what are the two minerals respectively? The first one, X is calcite. Y is quartz. X quartz and Y calcite. X scratched by metal coin. And Y scratched by streak plate. Let's go to read. Fluorite, X, quartz, Y. Apatite, X, Y, calcite. The answer must be calcite and the quartz X calcite is scratched by a coin mineral, metal coin, and Y is quartz quartz scratched by a streak plate. Here, he compare between the two minerals by scratching. Which of them has a more scratched? Let's go to 13, as science either. X is sulfide mineral of black streak. Y is carbonate mineral. Z is an oxide of red gray streak. Here he compare between them by the color. The first one, X sulfide golden. The carbonate green. The oxide will be red. Let's read the other. Sulfide will be yellow, white will be carbonate, red will be oxide, no. Golden, it will be sulfide, yes. White, it be carbonate, no. Carbonate is green. Lemon is oxide, no. Oxide is red. Black, white, red, the answer must be the first one. Golden is a sulfide. Green is a carbonate, red is oxide. It's the answer, number one. A, golden, green, and red. Here, the comparison between them about the color. Let's go 31. 31 speak about the sedimentary rocks. Sedimentary rocks here, it will be changed to igneous rocks. Let's read the question and answer it. Sedimentary rocks, to turn into igneous rocks, they must be passed through. There are three types of rocks, uh, general rocks. The first one is igneous rocks, the, the second is sedimentary, and the other is metamorphic. How to change? Uh, we cannot change it, but the nature do. We, cannot, we can change it at factors, but we speak about the nature here. Igneous rocks, it will be broken to make sediments. But here, 
we will go to the opposite one. Sedimentary rocks to igneous rocks. We change the sedimentary rocks to metamorphic rocks by pressure and temperature or heating. But sedimentary rocks must be go to igneous rocks. What are the steps? Let's read the choice first, then go to answer. Number eight, chemical weathering, then mechanical weathering. No, we cannot change it by chemical weathering or mechanical weathering. The chemical weathering by um, uh, uh, adding some substances which make the chemical reaction to uh, uh, convert the sedimentary rocks to igneous rocks. No. Number B. Pressure and the heating, it will make a metamorphic rocks, not an igneous rocks. C, melting and the crystallization. D, cooling and uh, solidification, not the last one, but must be C, melting and the crystallization. So the answer must be C, melting and then crystallization. It will, mean, it will make sedimentary rocks to igneous rocks. Let's go to 31. 31, speak about earth science either. If you found a different group of igneous rocks of the same color, here will be compare between igneous rocks with another factor. The factor here, which of the following is considered one of their similarities? Which of them are similarities? We speak about the igneous rocks. The igneous rocks has many similarities to each other. Number E, the size of crystals. The size of crystals are different and similarities because they are found on the Earth's crust or formed on the Earth's crust or formed in, inside, uh, uh, under the Earth's crust or inside the Earth. Number B, the place of crystallization. Uh, that's mean where they crystallization. That's mean who gave go first and the other go second, or by the temperature, the mineral composition. Uh, that's mean igneous rocks. They have the same mineral composition. This is similarities. The type of texture. It must be the mineral composition. It must be the similarities between igneous rocks.